May Shortman View. May is diagnosed with lazy eye as a child and grows up without any real friends. She considers the doll Susie her best friend. She grows up to be a very lonely young woman and things start to go bad when she becomes deeply attracted to a man named Adam, more specifically his hands. This is a pretty unique movie. I'm not sure one can completely call it a horror movie, even a psychological horror movie. And I'm also not entirely sure what else to call it. The acting is really strong, especially Angela Bettis, I believe her name is, who plays May. She delivers such a convincing performance and you really feel what she feels and really sympathize with her, which is not necessarily always the case with a lead who is very shy and nervous. Angela Anna Ferris proves that she can, you know, be something other than funny. The characters are quite well written, incredible, mostly likable. None of them are obnoxious, and they're pretty memorable because they're all, you know, they're several of them are just kind of weird in ways. The film is very creepy. Near the end, it becomes, it changes somewhat, and almost becomes a different movie. I'm not entirely sure the two, two parts fit together, but I do love both parts of the movie, and the ending is just perfect. It's filmed and edited quite well when it shows May observing someone who has some physical attribute that she's very attracted to, it kind of focuses on that part and we almost become a voyeur along with May, you know, observing that one part. If you like this review and want a more detailed one, check below, it's there as a video response. If not, it'll be in the description box. Please rate and comment and hey, if you like this video, that subscribe button's just waiting for you to click it.